I just had a chat with a doctor. I don't know. She told me another doctor had a big plan, quote, a big plan for me, okay? He's got a big plan. I said, well, if he's got a big plan, he needs to discuss that plan with me. Because the thing is, his plan is fundamentally flawed. From my perspective, which as far as they're concerned is the only perspective that should count right now, because it involves a CT and I'm not having a CT. I'm not. I'm not having more radiation. I've had so much radiation. I've eaten radiation. I have received it from x-rays, from CTs, on my pelvis, on my brain, on my fuck knows where I've had x-rays. I've eaten it. I've had it injected into my veins. They can give me an MRI and they don't want to because it costs more. I don't give a shit at this point in time. So the doctor needs to talk to me because he's got a big plan, but he's not telling me any of it. He's arranging a test, apparently, and he's not telling me when they are. I'm getting someone to come over tomorrow so that I can climb into my attic because I cannot climb into my attic alone right now because my balance is not good enough. It's not safe. I'm going to go climbing up ladders and pulling myself. I'll be at an attic right now with my balance the way it is. I want someone here in case something goes wrong. Oh, I know my own chest. Oh god, I need to bend these bastards over and I need to spread dry. Do you know what I'm saying? Very, very, very dry. I hate being with you, I just hate it. I don't know if you might be helpful, I'm not for other people, it's for the reason. I'm not all angels. I'm not angels. Anyway, I feel better saying this. Clicking my toe. <laughs> Sometimes you've just got to get it out, right? I've got to get it out. 